for an arty party, we're in the party time! It's the perfect place for a party, so let's get arty! It's the Mini Makers! Party, and look who I've invited, the shakes and sweats. He's so excited, all the mini makers are partying too. But most importantly, we invite you! Are you ready? My friend, it's great to see you. Now, what do you think we should make our party about today? Do you have a think? Have you got any ideas? Me. Come on, then, Mini Makers, over here, my friend. That's it, over you come. Have a look at the screen. We're going to show you some clues, see if you can guess what our party is going to be about today. Let's have a look. Oh, very swirly, isn't it? A snail with a swirly shell. And what shape is the lolly? Swirly. A swirly It is, and I'll give you one last clue, Mini Makers. It's my handkerchief with lots of swirly patterns on it. So, what's our party going to be about today? Swirls! That's right, we're going to have a swirly, whirly party today! Yay! Oh, wow. Come on, then, Scraps. Give us a twirl. <laughs> I mean, a swirl. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah! Hey, everyone, let's get swirly and whirly and make an arty party picture. Now, what should we use to make our picture today? Paint. And what should we squidge all of our paint on? Paper. What sort of colours should we use? Orange. So, should we use lots and lots of colours? Yes! And what should we tear the paper into? Circles. Squares. Rectangles. A triangle. Fantastic ideas, Mini Makers, and thank you, because that's just given me a brilliant idea. Let's get Artie at our party and get ourselves in a spin with swirls, whirls and twirls to make a brightly coloured pattern using scraps of coloured paper and paint. But first, we'll need some things from... The Beatles Team! That's right! <laughs> Some card and some scraps of coloured paper. Some paint and some glue. Ooh. Whoa! Doodle tube! All this spinning around has made me feel very dizzy. But thank you for all those swirls and twirls! All right then, Mini Makers, let's get started and make an arty party picture. Now, the first thing we're going to do is bring in all of our colourful scraps of paper and we're going to tear them into small pieces. Lots and lots of pieces now. Now, you don't have to be neat. 
and you can make whatever shapes you like. Just tear your colourful paper into small pieces. There we are. Which colour next? Green! All right, green it is. Here we go. We'll make some green pieces as well. You can tear any shape you want in any colour you like. And when you've got all of your colourful pieces, we need to stick them down onto some cards. I think this will work really well. All right then, Mini Makers, let's get gluing. Perfect. Now, that's the first one. Who's going to help me with some gluing? What about you, Michael? Yeah. All right then, my friend. Why don't you glue this piece there for me? It's a good job Michael's here, isn't it? He's a great help. Ready. Thank you, Michael. Oh, that looks perfect. Thank you very much, my friend. Well done. Right, let's stick some more. There we go. It's looking good already, isn't it? Yeah! And now we're going to add lots and lots of painty swirls to our picture. So let's take some paint and I'm going to very carefully squeeze the paint into twirly, swirly patterns. Bit gloopy, here we go. Hey, what do you think about that? That's nice. Shall I do another one? Yeah. All right, then, here we go. Keep swirling and twirling all over your picture until you're happy. And there we go, Mini Makers. Do you like this picture? Yeah! Well, now you're going to get your chance to make your very own arty party picture. But first, you need to put on your... Arty apron! That's right! Yeah! Because it's time to... And now, Nathan, I love what you've done with your picture here. Lots of paper shapes. And what have you done with the paint? Uh, well, I've used the green paint and squashed it into lots of different green circles. It's very swirly and very twirly. Well done, Nathan. Keep making. And I wonder, has anyone else ever had any arty, swirly ideas? Let's find out. Thousands of years ago, some people made pots by pushing a hole into a ball of clay and pinching up the sides. Others made a long snake of clay and coiled it into a pot shape. This was tricky to do and took a long time. Then, one day, someone had a brilliant idea. <gasps> That's it! Twist, spin and swirl. They invented a round wheel shape made of wood or clay on which to pop their pot. This new invention meant the potter could turn the pot by twisting and spinning the wheel round and round while sitting still. This made the making of the pot much easier and much faster. You. All this swirling could make you potty. <laughs> but you know, I think I finally cracked it. Ooh! Whoops. Wow, that really was top of the pots. Now, a long, long time ago, throw was another word for twirl, spin or swirl. And that's why today we say that potters throw a pot. <laughs> Now let's see how the Mini Makers are getting on. <laughs> wow, Mari, I love your picture. What's your favourite thing to do here? Doing the swells. Doing the swells. I love swells and twirls too. <laughs> so 
Tell me what you're doing now, Jessica. Um, putting the blue swirl on the pieces of paper I've ripped up. Wow, that's really nice. A blue swirl from Jessica. And what comes next? Um, I'm going to do a white swirl next. A white swirl. Well, there you go. Let's swap bottles. And away you go. Let's get swirly. Now, Naila, what sort of swirls have you made? I've got some little swirls on the outside and one big swirl in the middle. Well, I think it looks swirly brilliant. Well done, everyone. What's that noise? It, it sounds like someone's snoring. Who is it, everyone? The shapes! That's right, it's the shapes. And I think we should wake them up. So after three, ready? One, two, three. Whoa! I am a circle. Spin around, spin around in a circle on the ground. I am a triangle. Clap your hands in the air. Triangles everywhere. I am a square. Everybody draw a square. Draw it here. Draw it there. Bounce everybody! Bounce like you just don't care! What's it going to be? Wait and we will see a shape for you and me! I am a square! Yeah! What's hiding behind the squares? Any ideas? That's right. There are two swirly-tailed pigs. Well done, Square. It's time to get back on the shelf. Yay! <laughs> oh, look! It's Scraps! <laughs> Scraps surprise party popper! <laughs> To make a swirly chameleon like this, start by drawing a big swirly tail. Then draw some zigzags up from the tail to make the body and little leaf shapes for feet. Draw a sort of teardrop shape for a head. Then add a big eye, a mouth, and a nose like this. Last of all, add a swirly tongue. It's a curly-whirly, swirly-twirly chameleon. What a brilliant idea, Scraps. <laughs> and you can make any type of swirly picture you like. So, Noah, why don't you show us what you've made? I've made a person with swirly hair. Very nice, and I like the swirly hair. Lots and lots of different coloured swirls in the hair. I might try that one day. What have you made, Esther? Um, I've made a swirly tree with swirly branches and twirly leaves. Oh, it's a very nice tree. I wish that was in my back garden. And last but not least, what have you made, Brandon? I've made a swirly snake. A swirly snake with a swirly tongue. Great work, Mini Makers. Well done. And now for something completely different. Follow me. Come on, everyone, this way. Yeah! Here we go. Now, you are about to make a brilliant party picture. Have a look at the screen and see if you can guess what it's going to be. What picture are today's Mini Makers making? Any 
ideas. <laughs> what do you think it could be? Well done, Mini Makers. <laughs> and that sound means it's time for... Party Party Day! <laughs> so it's over to Party Cam to find out which Mini Makers are playing today. Off you go, Party Cam! <laughs> it's Jessica! Yeah! Who's next? Let's find out. And last but not least, here we go! It's Dylan! Yeah! Well done, my friends. You've been chosen for a very special arty challenge! Yeah! Today's spectacular swirly game is called There's a Hole in My Bucket. Actually, there's a hole in all of my buckets. Mini makers, you need to use these buckets filled with paint to make a swirly picture on this big piece of paper that we put on the floor. Now, you must remember, as soon as you take the plug out of your bucket, it's going to get very messy. And that's why you're wearing your arty party suits and we put down lots of old paper first. So, Dylan, Veronica and Jessica, do you think you can do it? But you must be very quick. You've got to finish your twirly, swirly picture before Scraps makes this noise. <laughs> Ready, steady. OK, then, Dylan, you start first. Here you go. Take out the plug and start swirling. Whoa! <laughs> Good start. Well done, Dylan. Very good, Dylan. Well done. High five. Now it's Veronica's turn. Go on, give it a swing. Wow, oh, yes, very good. Very nice. Veronica, that was amazing. High five. And now, Jessica, it's your turn. That's it. Go on. Oh, brilliant. Well done. That was brilliant. Over you come, Jessica. Let's watch it. Oh, that was brilliant. What a good shot. <laughs> oh, time's up! Yay! Well done, Mini Makers. This is a swirly, twirly, spectacular picture. Well done, my friends. But now it's time to tidy up. Come on, Mini Makers, let's get started. I'll help you in a minute. We've had a brilliant arty party today. Ooh. We've had a wonderful swirly party, making brightly coloured patterns and swirly drawings. We've learned how a spinning wheel made pottery making easier. And we played There's a Hole in My Bucket to make a super swirly picture. We've been arty at our arty party. Are you ready? Your first just that's right, our party's over, but your arty fun is just beginning. It's time to put the party pad back in its box. See you soon, everyone. Bye! <laughs>